Hey guys, so spring is finally right around the corner. Um, I feel really ridiculous saying this because right now it is pouring rain outside where I live and I live in California, so you'd think that I'd have warm weather, but I don't. I literally cannot wait for warmer weather. I am freezing my butt off. I am so pale. I want to get tan. I want a bathing suit. I want to be out of school. I want summer, all that. So spring is the next little step there. So I thought I'd do my spring nail polish guide for you guys and what I really like to wear. I know a lot of this stuff is going to be repeats because a lot of people are doing this video and um, everyone's been sticking with the same trends, which are pastels and stuff, but I just thought I'd show you the polishes that I like and the ones that I plan on wearing for spring because I am a nail polish junkie. So I'm going to go in order of the rainbow because I'm dorky like that and I liked making it look like rainbow. So the first color that I absolutely adore for spring is No Spain No Gain by OPI and it is just this berry color. I absolutely love this. It's perfect for fall and spring as well. It's one of those transitional colors. Okay, I may be on crack but I do, I change my nail polishes to go with seasons by like with a transition. So I wouldn't automatically go from like a black to a hot pink. So I do like transitional colors. And I definitely think spring is a transitional season and it's a time for transitional colors, which is like this color. Which is no surprise because it's basically one of my all time favorite nail polishes. And this is Bubble Bath by OPI and it's this light pink. It's super, super pretty. I love this pastel. It's basically like the pink that's almost nude, which I absolutely love. I definitely want looking for a good nude polish. So if you guys know a really great nude polish, please comment down below. And I'll love you forever. And I, so the next color in the rainbow is orange. <laughs> yeah, I went to kindergarten. Solid. And it says Peachy Keen by China Glaze. And China Glaze is my absolute favorite nail polish brand. And it is this peach color. And I adore it. My friends are like, that's such a strange color to paint on your nails. Like, won't that look weird? I'm like, no, I like it. Like, won't, won't you look sickly? I'm like, no, I like it. I think it's super, super cute, and I love, 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 love pastels for spring. Like, obviously, because I'm wearing, like, a pastel cardigan to, like, get in the mood of spring. <laughs> get in the mood. Set the ambiance. So the next color is yellows, and I only have one yellow in this, and this is Banana Bandana by OPI. Oh, my God, I love this. It's basically the OPI version of Lemon Fizz, and, oh, it's so, so, so pretty. Again, my friends think this is one of those colors that's going to make me look sickly. And when I say friends, I mean Sydney, because I do really only have one friend. No, I don't. Don't judge me. Don't judge me. So the next polish has literally been featured in every single one of these videos, and duh, it has, because it is the best spring color ever. It is honestly, like, my obsession. I'm so excited to start wearing this, and it is Refresh Mint by China Glaze, and it's just this light green mint color, and it's so, so, so pretty. I haven't... So next is also what I would consider a transitional color. And this is Four Leaf Clover by China Glaze. And it is a... Why is it coming off blue? I'm holding... It's a grass green. It's super, super pretty. Super bright, but not like too, too summery bright. It's more long lines of spring bright. And it's a perfect transitional color to go from winter to spring. And I did not include Chatty Glaze for Audrey because everyone and their mother included that in this video. And I love that color, but I thought I'd include something that I haven't seen in a lot of spring nail polish guide videos. And that is one of the newest polishes to China Glaze from there. I don't know what collections it's from. Ships Ahoy. Ahoy, matey. Sails away. Ships. Boats. I don't know. Something like that. And it's called Sea Spray. And it's this pearlized blue. Oh my god. It is so pretty. It's like a baby blue that has a hint of gray in it, which I really like for spring. I think it's a perfect, perfect, perfect color. I love that. So the next polish is a little out of my character. I'm one of those people who I either love glitter nail polishes, like legit glitter nail polishes, or cream polishes. As you may have noticed, every other polish in this video is going to be a cream polish because I don't really like shimmery polishes, but I am freaking obsessed with this Oh my god, so many. Crystal by Zoya. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh, oh my god, are you looking at that? Oh my god. It's so freaking pretty. I'm like dying. Oh my god. Oh my god. It's like this blue with a whole bunch of like sparkles and stuff. And like, oh. Paying attention to the fact that this is in rainbow order, you know the next color in the rainbow is purple! Is it done out in deco by OPI? Oh, thummy. Move thumb. Thumb, 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 thumb. Anyone else watch Spy Kids? Love that movie. Done at in Deco, and it's just this pastel lilac purple color. I absolutely love this. Oh, I got sneeze. <laughs> we 
honest, I really don't follow what's like in. I just like pretty colors in pastels. That's why I like Easter. Like eggs, chocolate, pastels. Come on, what else is there not to like? So the next polish is the only drugstore polish in here. And I'm super sorry for that, but you have to understand, for me, I consider China Glaze drugstore polishes because I buy them discounted online. And obviously it's not a good deal if you buy like two because you have to pay shipping, but I, I'll buy like six polishes at a time. So then I'm literally paying like the same amount of my wood as like for a drugstore nail polish. So I'll link all the places I buy discounted OPI and China Glaze down below so you guys can score some awesome deals like I do because I love it and it's awesome. Wind White by Sally Hands and InstaDry, and you guys, if you've been watching my videos for a while, you know this is my all-time favorite drugstore nail polish brand. Oh my god, I I love it. It's such a pretty white color. It's a true white. It's not a cream. It's not an off-white. It's not an eggshell. It is white with a tan. It's like ba bam bronzed Rihanna Golden Goddess. It is so hot. So finally, nail polish may come as a bit of a surprise to you guys, but I absolutely love this for springtime, and this is China Glaze's Recycle. And obviously it's not a pastel, it is a full on gray color. And it's what I'm wearing on my nails right now. But I don't know, I really like it for spring. I think it's another one of those transitional colors that you can wear basically year round. Obviously I probably wouldn't wear this in summer because it is a little grungy for that. But I really like it. Like the whole thing of like wearing pastels with like a gray nail polish. Oh, oh this is really tripped. But I don't know, I think it's super cute. So I hope you guys enjoyed and all the polishes will be listed in the down bar. And along with the websites where I buy discounted polishes, and please, please, please do me a massive, massive favor and comment down below and tell me what your favorite nude polish is. I'm right now looking at like Dolce Light, Dolce de Leche, Dolce Leche. There's one from LPI that looks pretty as well as Barefoot in Barcelona, but I'm really not sure because you guys know my skin tone. Um, you know my skin tone. So what do you think would look good on me? If you got similar skin tone to me, let me know. And if you is constraining me. Out of the box, out of the box, is there more words to this song? I don't know.